the opportunities are wide open for him. That's just the first step in the right direction. Bassem and Mohamed Maswade are father and son, but they're also boss and employee. Mohamed is a sophomore at Leon County Virtual School, and now he's dual enrolled for Lively Technical College's automotive program so he can join his dad's business full-time when he graduates. That I'm able to help my dad and I'm able to, you know, make a, um, be able to do business with him and be able to be successful with him and something, I, you know, I can't ask for more. The Maswades took part in Lively Technical College's first signing day for students and employers. Bossam says the opportunity will help his son have a better life than he did. So he doesn't have to work till age 50 or 40 for that matter. He's at the end of the game. If he keeps his head straight and keep his dreams and goals and community education, then he should be set and, and have residual income and not work as hard as I did. Chelsea Williams, the K-12 through Career and Technical Education Coordinator for Leon County Schools, says their dual enrollment programs can help trade industries fill open positions. A lot of them do um, apprenticeships with them, internships with them, and so this is a great um, talent pool for employers and people in our community to pull from for their pipeline. Leon County Schools pays for the dual enrollment program. William says getting the education for free is invaluable to students. We teach these young men and young women that these are skills that they can take and be lifelong learners, whether they use it in their career or not, but these are invaluable skills that they can always keep with them. Mohammed's advice to anyone considering dual enrollment is to take advantage of the golden opportunity. You know, be able to learn and keep it with you because, you know, vocational school and vocational skills, if they're kept with you, they can be very useful down life.